All right. Hello, everybody. It's Kinder Badge Car with LPT Realty and Maxine Carey, Guardian Mortgage. Hi, everyone. We are super excited to share with you today that we're going to be bringing a podcast your way called Your Road to Home, where we hope to share some insightful real estate knowledge with you and get you connected to the Carbon Valley area where we serve and live. Um, we've got some amazing people that we've met along the way through our own um, business journeys that we'd like to share with you. Some awesome people that we think you're going to love to get to know. And we'd like to share their stories with you and just help you on your road to your home, hopefully, in the near future. Right. Um, Kendra and I both know how important home ownership is. We are very proud of the, the homes that we have built and our families. So we understand, oh, this is a bumpy road, sorry everyone. Um, we understand that a real estate tr transaction is more than just the door you're walking through. It's the home you're creating. It's the community that you're gonna live in. You know, maybe raise your kids in, walk your dog in, that sort of thing. So we wanna introduce you to our area. Um, you know, no, we can help you wherever, but um, yeah, we're just proud of our area. And like I said, we wanna share it and hopefully, hopefully create or plant the seed, I guess, and help you on, on your road to home. Yep, exactly. So we're gonna be picking up some of our friends and putting them in the back seat here to ask them some questions to help you get to know them and hopefully offer some value to you as well. We've got a great lineup coming your way already, starting with, uh, we've got Melissa Foote with Step by Step Technology. We've got Nicole Zollner with JNT Property Solutions, and we've got Don Short from Short D's Coffee. Um, so all local run businesses, all incredible ladies that you're gonna love getting to know. Um, we'll have that coming your way in the next couple of weeks here. And yeah, so maybe we can just share a couple insights of what we are seeing in the market today with you guys and what we're kind of predicting for real estate 2024. Yeah, well, you can start with that. The market is hot. The market Mar has started off with fireworks in January, um, which kind of wasn't expected, really. I didn't really expect things to pick up till springtime, but I'd say the minute January 1 started rolling around, my phone started ringing and the market's right. really started heating up. We're seeing an increase in the number of showings. We're seeing a decrease in the days on market. Um, we're seeing multiple offers and competitive situations in some certain areas as well already. So, I mean, we're, we'll wait and see what interest rates end up doing for the rest of the year, but right now the, the buyer energy is is up right now so right and you know I think to to play on that rates were down the first part of the year mm -hmm. they have kind of ticked up a little bit but they continue on that downward trajectory or they go up and then they tick back down and then they go up and then they tick back down so if you are patient and get your financing in order first you know so all the hiccups are done and you don't have to worry about any of that you know when you can lock your rate mm -hmm. um, you know when rates come you know, we're on that downward trajectory again. Right. Yeah. I'd say if you're thinking about making a move anytime this year, you definitely need to get in contact with your local lender, your financial person and get a plan in place because that helps us do our job better to negotiate the best deal for you as well. Um, if you guys have any questions about real estate along the way, we'd love to hear them. Just drop it in the comments for us. We'll definitely get around to getting a response to you. Um, anything else that we need to mention on here no just you know um don't worry about you know if you think your credit's bad or if you don't have money for your down payment yes. again like Kendra said you're financing first you know pull your credit get to know where you are with that if you need some time to pay off a credit card or get a credit card so that you can have credit you know those things if you can get ahead of those before you know you get out shopping um, that's always best. There's a few down payment assistance programs in Colorado. Um, I have some proprietary ones, you know, so there's, there's lots of ways to get you into a home. So if you, and, and don't worry if you just started a new job, you know, there's, ju there's just lots of things that you can talk through, um, in regards to your financing first. That's probably the scariest part of of starting your home journey is, oh my gosh, I'm not ready. You know, what about this? What about that? Yeah. You know, talk to your lender, me, Maxine. Um, and like I said, get in front of that stuff first and then know exactly where your budget is before you get up shopping. And then you know what you're looking for. Yep, that's it. That's the best advice right there. Know what your budget is. Then you can sit down with your agent and put your game plan together on the best way to structure your offers. 
Um, so yeah, we're really excited to bring this new podcast to you guys. We hope that you get a lot of value out of it. Um, learn a little bit more about the Carbon Valley area. If you don't already live here, we encourage you to check it out because it's a beautiful place to live. And if you do live here, we're going to offer some great value to you guys as we yeah. introduce you to more people in the community. So, Right. That's awesome. So we look forward to seeing you on your road to home and introducing you to maybe your new community. How many homes are on sale in this community, by the way? Like, I know inventory was down, right? Inventory was down, but with all the new construction coming up and everything out here, you know, I was just telling a client about this the other day. Two years ago when I was searching for available homes, you know, for, for buyers just in Frederick Firestone, I'd maybe see five at a time. And now there's, you know, like 60 different opportunities for you out there. So I would say our inventory specifically right here in Carbon Valley is up. It may not be that way across the state and in certain markets, but we definitely have some opportunities out here. So come out and take a look. Yeah, and you see those lovely views and, mm -hmm. you know, acreages that we're passing along on our drive. Anyway, we uh, can't wait to see you on the road to home. All right. Thank you, guys. We'll talk to you soon. Bye.